Welcome to And The Women Gather. I am Lorna Owens. Ten years ago, I was looking under my bed for a quarter. I had lost everything, even though I was an attorney, a nurse, and an author. Eight years ago, we started And The Women Gather as a literary jazz brunch at the Ritz-Carlton. 500 women, five best-selling author, and today, we are a television show. The power of women will heal this world you can reach me by tramway you can reach me by railway you can reach me on an airplane you can reach me with your mind the power of women who will heal this world know that in order to really speak directly to my people, to African American people, I needed to and understand the crisis that we're in, not just here in the United States, but all throughout the Caribbean, all throughout our motherland in Africa. Believe it or not, I'm, I'm called to the UK. You know, I'm called to bring the mentoring movement there. I'm not ready to do that. I'm called to Canada. I'm not ready to do that. Because wherever we are, we're in crisis and we've got to figure it out. And I said, you cannot just step out there without understanding the, the reasons. And that's the, re that's the thing that media never ask. We read about all of our pain, we see it on the nightly news, we read about it in the daily newspapers, but nobody ever asks why. What did black people lose in being stolen from our motherland? What did we lose, what did our motherland le lose in losing us? They lost their wealth. The wealth of millions of young people who should have been there. You know, you ask right, yourself, right. what would America be two, three hundred years from now if millions of young people were siphoned off? The power of women who will heal this world. You know me, Lorna. We've known each other for how many years? Okay. We <laughs> know now that we've been collecting. You've bought from me, and I thank you. You're validated artist. And I love it. Every day when oh, I get up, it gives you. me such great pleasure. And joy. Yes, yes. But if, you, if, if you're not intentional in doing so, it won't happen. One piece a year. Over 20 years, you have 20 pieces. And if you buy what you like, your house will be enhanced with the beauty. I cannot live without my art. I just can't. The power of women will heal this world. So here you're a woman, Latin America, female going to Latin America. Right. Were you concerned that the men would think that this is not a woman's job? Well, everybody told me that. They told me you would never make it in Latin America because it's a male-dominated industry. Right. And in being in the computer industry was also unique. Yes. So I had two things against me, but I didn't pay any attention. I thought if I know what I'm doing, they're going to respect my knowledge and they're going to accept me. And that was exactly what happened. People talked to me and realized I knew what I was selling and they forgot I was a woman. The power of women who will heal this world. Long story short, I was ready to give up and the first article came out and it was a review mm -hmm. on this gem of a Caribbean on Lincoln Road. And when I read that article, I went, oh my goodness, I can do this. I did it. Yeah. And I was in shock over it. I was more shocked than anyone. A lot of my friends were like going, are you crazy? What are you doing? Yeah. And I said, I, I, I can do this. I can do this. People hear about Ortonique. I'm very happy about it. Uh, by word of mouth, more than anything, they come because somebody else that has dined here has brought them. And to me, that's more valuable than anything. If you come here with a table of five people, or we want something a little tropical or that may right. reflect Miami, and you bring them in here, I can guarantee you that even if they're from out of town, the next time somebody's going to Miami, they're going to say, oh, there's this little place in Coral Gables or Tanique. Go eat there. The power of women who will heal this world. For one night, with one hour, with one message, Paul Bragg inspired me in such a way I can't describe, and helped me see a new possibility for my life. And he, he believed in me more than I believed in myself, and he saw within me a capacity to do something I didn't believe I could do, and that was to be able to read and, and do something with my life. The power of women who will heal this world. 
imagine a girl could have an attitude. I mean, these are attitude <laughs> oh, bags, okay? You have, to, you, know, you have to feel good about yourself right. to carry an angel bag. And the last leather one is this one. And this is with peacock feathers. Oh, wow. Oh, this one is Like great. real peacock, okay. not the fake, fake one or anything like that? Nothing no. fake? Oh, okay. No, no, these are real peacock and leather with leather and suede. The power of women who will heal this world. I'm here at Frank Provost to have my makeup done. It's only five minutes, but before we do, tell me a little bit about your store. Oh, Frank Provost is the biggest name worldwide in the hair industry. We own 600 beauty salons worldwide. Okay. We are in 20 countries and we do over 2 million clients a year. Wow, wow. So and it's the first one in the United States. Okay, and you chose Miami, Biscayne Boulevard. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I still don't believe you can do my makeup in five minutes, so let's check it let's, out. Let's do okay. it. Power of women who will heal this world. Let's go. All right. I'm modeling. I told you I could do it. I don't. Open your eyes. It is open. No. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> The power of women, united we stand. We're making a difference when we join hands. It's the power of women who will heal this world. The power of 